Jennifer. Today, students at Bick Elementary in the Russell neighborhood got an important lesson on how to stop bullying. It comes at a time when JCPS leaders are ramping up efforts to eliminate bullying from all of its schools. WLKY's Manash Kunguari shows us the message kids were given and how they're using it. And you continue to bully this person each and every day. A sincere message. They feel like garbage. To a room full of third, fourth, and fifth graders at Big Elementary. A message that comes straight from the heart of Florida native Jalen Arnold. This is how I felt at some point. Because he knows firsthand what it's like to be bullied. And I know this is how a lot of you guys have felt at some point. At just two years old, he was diagnosed with Tourette's, then came diagnoses of Asperger's and OCD. A trio of medical syndromes he says paved the way for him to be bullied while growing up. Now, with the help of Global Game Changers, he travels to schools all over the country sharing his story. Now I know that bullying is not good, and if you get either, if you get bullied, just tell the teacher. A simple message for the students here at Bick that couldn't have come at a better time. District data shows one in four JCPS students experience bullying on their respective campus. It's why this year the district is unrolling a new bully prevention program called Oveus. It's being piloted at 25 schools. Um, three in each elementary zone, five in uh, middle school, five in high school. According to Crystal Gray, JCPS Bully Prevention Department Supervisor, the program is a proven method that requires students, faculty, and staff to work together to create a no-bullying atmosphere. We are educating students on what to do, how to do it, making sure that you're not a bystander, but you're a defender, that you speak up on somebody's behalf. Gray says it's their way of making sure the bullying doesn't reach a breaking point. Sometimes it can get like serious where where the kid can either like hurting herself or hurting himself. An all hands on deck approach to an issue many schools are taking and the kids here at Bic are getting the message. In Louisville, Minaj Kungwari, WLKY News. And the Oveas program that Minaj mentioned is currently at 25 schools. Leaders say they hope to start it at 25 more schools next school year.